Hi all, this video is designed to show you the purity of your gold. To do this you need a few things. First of all, you need some gold. And you need a small scale that will measure your gold, a bit of cotton to tie on to your gold, and a small beaker of water at room temperature. Firstly, place your gold on the scale and mark down the weight of each piece of gold on a piece of paper. The entire piece of cotton to each piece of gold so that you can lower it into the water. Take the beaker of water and put it on the scale and then zero out the scale. I do this by turning it off and back on and it should go to zero. Then pick up your first piece of gold and lower it into the water. Be careful not to lower it all the way to the bottom. Make a note of the weight change in the water when the gold is in the water. That was 0.32 of a gram on that piece. Do the same with all of your pieces and make a note of their weight. Now what you need to do to find the specific gravity of the nugget is take the weight, the original weight, 4.53 grams in the case of the first one and 4 in the second one and divide it by the weight that you got when you weighed it in the water. This will give you a number. The number is then referenced onto a density table which I'll provide in a link on the um, video below and it'll give you a number for each piece of gold as a specific gravity number of that gold. Now that you've got the uh, specific gravity density numbers of each piece of gold, you take that number and you reference it on the table to the range that it fits into. Look to your left and you'll find that it's got an 18 carat, um, K stands for carat, now looking back at the uh, two pieces of gold, you'll notice that they've got different SG numbers. One is shinier than the other, which means they've got a different composition and probably a different gold content. So you look back up at the table and uh, the um, area that it's in fits into a 14 carat piece of gold. The two pieces of gold also have different alloy combinations. When you look at their SG numbers, the, uh, the bigger one has a copper and silver content being closer to 1524 and the other one has a silver content uh, or alloy which is 14.3. So these two pieces of gold were both bought, uh, found within the same area on, a, um, on the same field in the Victorian gold fields. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video and can make use of it. Please be sure to press the like button at the bottom of the video. Thank you.